Now, two restaurants in Brighton are joining forces uh, with a whole raft of others nationwide today to launch an auction to raise funds which will hopefully make a difference to hospitality workers affected by the coronavirus pandemic. Monday's online auction includes a range of top culinary and alcoholic delights. Uh, Stephen Edwards uh, is the owner and chef at Etch and Razak Halalat is from the Coal Shed and they join me to tell us more. Um, Stephen, there's some brilliant lots in this auction aren't there uh, to be honest i haven't seen a better auction if, I, if i'm honest like the the list is better than i think we could have imagined yeah what would you go for um now you put me on the spot i mean i'd obviously <laughs> go for i'd obviously go for my one that's that's what i'm gonna say but the chefs from um like Spain, Italy, France, there's like, it's not just the UK. Like I thought when they're putting it together, it was just going to be like the top 100 list. But they've done a great job in getting like hundreds and hundreds of restaurants together to put um, to put this auction together and stuff that's that's not available to buy. Yeah. So what have you put forward? Uh, so we put our private dining experience with me cooking a bottle of night timber for up to six guests and a nine course signature menu. Very nice too. How much do you reckon you'll get for it? Um, that's a good question. I mean, no, normally these sort of things go for over a thousand pounds, but I mean, it's really. I mean, that, the whole point of it is just to raise awareness for hospitality action and yeah. ultimately raise as much money as well. Um, so, I mean, it'd be incredible to be part of this um, this, this auction and also to, to raise as much money. Yeah. Um, let's chat to Razak Helalak from the Coal Shed. Um, obviously, as Stephen said, it's all about raising money for people who've been affected by the coronavirus pandemic. It's been a really tough time for the hospitality industry, hasn't it? Oh, yes, yes, yes. It's been very, very tough. I think it's... Um, you know, the pandemic, I think this has been the industry that's been hard hit it really. And I think this is the one that's going to probably take the longest to recover, especially with all the social distancing, people not having confidence in going out, mm. you know, people losing their jobs, <clears throat> all these things. I think it's, it's just going to take a, a, a quite a long time for it to come back, really. But, yeah, although this whole yeah. eat out to help out scheme, I mean, the restaurants that I've been to have been absolutely packed. Yes, yes. No, the, I think all, pretty much every restaurant that I've been speaking to just said they've been absolutely fully booked. You yeah, know, you can't Monday, get a table Tuesday. for Love No Money in Brighton. No, 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 you can't, which is just an amazing thing. So, you know, it just goes to show that people really want to go out and, you know, really help support the local restaurants, which is, you know, which is obviously very important to every local community, really. Yeah. But no, what it's have, fantastic. What have you put up for auction? We have put up an auction. It's um, it's for our sister restaurant, The Salt Room. Um, so, but we're going to be going as a whole team to uh, be meeting the our fish suppliers at uh, BNFS or Fish, who are just down by the harbour, by Port Slade. Where who they supply most of the fish to all the local restaurants and 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 into London as well. So we're going to go there, have a look behind the scenes, uh, meet some of the uh, uh, fishermen there. Then hopefully, weather depending, um, we're going to be taking a, a a boat out and we're going to go and have a day's fishing. We're going to go quite far out, so hopefully we can catch some some uh, some special fish and um, and then come back and then the chefs will cook. Um, the fish that we've caught, wow. uh, we've caught that day, yeah, with some lovely How match wines. So. Amazing. <laughs> yeah, there are, fantastic. as Stephen says, you know, some amazing lots on there. Stephen Edwards uh, from Etch, uh, Razak Hella from uh, the Salt Room and the Coal Shed, thank you so much. That auction then will go live in four days' time via the website www.nationalrestaurantawards.co.uk. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.